What's up guys, this is iTweaks here, and today I'm going to be showing you a brand new tweak that just hit Cydia called Classic Switcher. Now what this tweak allows you to do is actually give you an iOS 6 style switcher with quite a bit more features. Now for this video I've actually turned on the activator where if I double tap on the status bar it's going to bring up the app switcher rather than me double tapping the home button. So just keep that in mind, that's what I'm doing right now. So you can see that this is the original iOS 7 app switcher here but if we go into classic switcher settings then we can enable this straight from the settings now we don't have to respring or anything like that and if we open up the app switcher again you can see you get that nice blur as well as that iOS 6 style uh, app switcher right there and you can scroll through just like that and if you want to delete all the applications running in the background then you can pull it all the way to the right and if you let go from right here then it's going to delete all the applications it'll give you a little pop-up just like that do you want to quit all the apps you can say yes or no I'm gonna tap no just for this video and we're gonna go through all of the settings here now here's where you can change the amount of rows in your app switcher so if you wanted to change it to two you can see that that's going to show you two separate rows now if we change it to three and we open that up uh, actually we have this toggled on so now if we open it up you can see it's going to give you three rows. So if I tap that back on, we don't need that third row, so it's not showing it, as you can see right there. Now, down here, you can quit all the apps like I was just showing you, so this gives you that option. Also, right here, if you have Always Editing toggled on, then if we toggle that on and open up the App Switcher, first of all, you're going to see that you always have that minus button right up there in the corner. You can tap those just to close out like just like that. You also can close out all the applications if you have this toggled on just by tapping and holding and it's going to give you this pop-up, do you want to quit all the apps? So let's go back here. You also have this ask before quitting all, which is also really nice. Now down here we have overlay style. So you can see when I open up the app switcher, we get that blur right up there. We can change that just by changing this right here. So if we want a white overlay, you can see you get a white overlay. If we do black, it basically just dims it out right there, or you can just have no overlay. So it's going to look just like that. Now another really cool part of this, I'm a fan of blur so I'm going to leave that, is the actual opening animation. So you can see that this is slide up, which is what we have right here. We have the uncover just like iOS 6, which is going to uncover, or you have slide up. And it's going to look just like that. So quite a few features for Classic Switcher. Let me know what you guys think about this tweak in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. If you want to see more of my videos, then go ahead and subscribe. Also, don't forget to like my Facebook page and follow me on Twitter for updates. And if you haven't checked out my gaming channel, go over there and stop by and say hey. Alright guys, until next time, peace.